Hey, Maganda Romaga, como está, everybody? This is God Expert in the Philippines. We're on our way over to see. My mom. Say hello to Oki. He's CJ's little best friend. Yeah, and he plays with me too. We're going over to see, see Mummy. Over at Sunshine Hospital. CJ coming too. Yeah. It's not bad, it's sunny and overcast, which is good. I've got my coffee on the go go. And I got my chocolate. I know, this, new, this is a bamboo cup. Apparently made out of bamboo, but it looks like it's only made out of steel. Aluminium. It is, because I see some steel. They say it's Maybe made out of bamboo. It. Maybe they painted. <laughs> Someone's taken a lint of themselves. <laughs> Yeah, so it's sort of semi-overcast. I've got the front, uh, the back uh, garden done this morning with hosing because we haven't had really that much rain. So I've had to do that. Um, and then I had to do the front. I don't know, our ground seems to either chew up the rain water and not... Uh, keep it there some some gardens the rainwater seems to just sit on top but uh, ours sort of goes straight through doesn't really sit so um, you, know, you can water the garden and it'll be like little bubbles and then it'll uh, slowly seep through but our garden that just goes straight through to the wherever it's going. <laughs> but everything like being winter and now coming on to uh, slowly coming into spring, things are slowly starting to uh, blossom and the leaves are starting to come out again. So. That's not bad. You enjoying that chocolate, CJ? Yeah. The building ours is over there. I'm like, my octi right here? Yeah, I put octi right behind me. So you can look out the window. Oh. McDonald's has been finished over here, so it's KFC. So yeah. I've got McDonald's KFC over and there McDonald's. and KFC over there now. Yep. Yeah. And I went to the new McDonald's too. Yeah, CJ went to the new McDonald's. And I, and I didn't even order a grimace shake because that will happen sometime. <laughs> I'm not lying to you. A grimace shake? Yeah, the grimace shake. Coffee seems to tickle the back of my throat and make me cough for some unreason. Doesn't do that with lattes, only just when it's hot. Put an 
of sugar in there and still not sweet enough. That's alright, I am. No, CJ enjoys eating just plain chocolate. Cadbury's. And, and with the picture with the football, because I, I mean the soccer. The soccer, he's sponsoring the FIFA. Yeah, because I like soccer. I think we play Monday, CJ. The Matildas play Monday. going down guys, uh, got live stream tonight, um, starting tonight, having the live stream, so 12 o'clock AM Australia time, 10 o'clock Philippine time. As I said, I'm sorry I haven't put up one a live stream earlier, but it's pretty hard when you're busy chasing around other, after other people, especially my dear wife who's in hospital, makes it hard. too happy. Next door's poisoned her choke. Choco, I think that's what you call it, choco. And uh, all the leaves are poisoned. So I wouldn't be surprised if the fruit's poisoned on it, or vegetable is poisoned on it too. So I have to tell Arlene not to eat it, because it can go through to the main source of the thing. Which is a shame because it was starting to grow nice vegetables. There was plenty going to be on it, but now it looks like we have to uh, cut it back by the look of things now and regrow it. And the uh, thing it's on. At the moment, it's not really withstanding, so that could be pulled apart, and we might have to put a new frame up. Uh, being wood, wood don't last long when you're uh, using the frames. If it's trellis, it's okay, but wood doesn't last. And if I do take it away, I'll, I can put some trellis up there and stop it from going over the other side. We'll have to do that. She's not. She won't be too happy because all the leaves up the top are gone, uh, dying, and uh, the back of it was full bushed. Was you know looking good now. It's, I reckon the cow next door um, poisoned it because. We haven't had the winter, the ice, 
a cold winter to um, you okay CJ? Alright. You wanna go sleep? Okay. Yeah. Thank you. Um as I said, we haven't had the ice cold winters this year to dye the grass and dye the uh, choco up like it did last year. It came in real hard and really uh, killed it off. So um, we're going to have to cut it all back. And uh, the arch frame I'll have to put over the top and uh, take it away from the fence line and grow it up the arch which might make it a lot better and it can, the other plant that's underneath will survive a lot better so will the uh, loganberry that will do a lot better without it being all over the top of the And as I said to Ali, you got to make sure when you're um, planting things like that, and also it seems to take over the whole rose bush on the fence. Um, because it's like a, it's like a weed, and it's similar to pumpkin, and it grows like pumpkin. It just goes everywhere. So um, we'll um, retrain it to go up and go somewhere else, which will be a lot better for it. So uh, I brought an arch to go over the footpath, and it's grown over that okay but uh, the top of it I don't know whether she sprayed and it's gone all over it I'm not sure but she's a cow she should have told me I would have come around I went to go around last time and her nephew told me not to bother so I thought okay no worries fine war has started uh, we will uh, endeavour <laughs> we'll endeavour to redo the plant again. I'll just cut it right back, cut it back again and uh, train it over the arch this time and uh, try and keep it away from the fence. And I'll put uh, two other plants on our side to cover um, or probably three trees to cover her um, ugly fence. Short abbreviation. Ugly head. Uh, people get very, very angsty towards me because all I'm trying to do is grow fruit and grow vegetables and because it creeps over the fence and you don't get a chance to get around the back of it they get very shitty because it goes over their fence and into their plants and then because they don't get a pair of plump pruners which are snippers to cut the tree or the uh, vines back they would rather poison it. Like, you know, that sort of vegetable, fruit vegetable, whatever you, choco, is very nice to eat. It has an acquired taste, but it's not bad, you know. So, I don't know why. I really don't. I shake my head. Adder. 
What have you been up to this morning, Boof? CJ? <laughs> He's been drawing with Granny. But he didn't do Granny's feet for Daddy. Help Daddy out. Where are you going, mate? You should see this guy. He's going straight across. He's like turning. Mm. He's like going like that way a bit. He's like going this way a bit. Yeah. Geez, these stay hot in here. I'd keep, I'd keep the lid on it, but I'm frightened. I reckon if I went to the hospital, went in and came out, it'd still be, it'd be like lukewarm. No. No. He's flying. <laughs> my God. I keep thinking I've got something on my shoulder. Might be my um, singlet I got up underneath that I got from the Philippines. I got five of them. And geez, they're nice and warm. Here in Australia, they keep you warm. God, he's climbed up there, he's going to scare Daddy. Oh. <laughs> uh. Uh. Look at the water, some sort of tanker in front of us. <laughs> Daddy knew he gave himself a heart attack. You know why? Because I'm always putting my wallet back in my bag and I end up putting it in my pocket and I don't know why. Probably because that's where it belongs sometimes. But uh, I usually keep it in my bag when I'm um, thing. Rocky must be in a good mood. What? I don't know why. What? He was in a bad mood yesterday when you put him in in your bag or you plushed him down. Who? Rocky. Him. You mean Nocti? Octi. Oh, sorry. It's Octi, not Octi. Your mummy's croissants. 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 And croissants. Can you are you able to take the croissants out and put them in that other bag for daddy? Mm, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Be I've been octified. <laughs> yeah. I'm yeah. Yeah. Little CJ's bit new best mate. It's Octi. Octi. Did you bring your drawing pens? Yeah, it's in the oh, bag. Okay, it's in the bag. Everything in the bag. We're gonna. It's gonna be a slow boat to not China, but uh, to sunshine the way we go on. I'm not in a hurry. I don't need speed points. <laughs> so I will. Just try and take her off a bit. <laughs> I don't want to go to the Philippines yet. Well, we're not going till Christmas time anyway. Yeah. Not going till December. Mm -hmm. Got to see how mummy is. It's Christmas. Hmm? Yeah, in March. Oh, March. After Christmas. Is it after Christmas? No, December. December. Oh, 
contact policy. But I lived, I'm not living in the car in Lewis that I lived, but uh, I think we've got a small, tiny little Argentinian ant something like that in there. I've got to keep the cover on. It's because this car gets parked underneath the trees. You wouldn't think so with the way the uh, um, roof is at the moment. No, Chris Beecham, it's not my toy, it's CJ's. I'm just leaving him there. CJ's is leaving him there. Forever. Forever? Did you have a nice sleep last night, CJ? Yeah. Mm. Still tired. Still tired? <laughs> You're not going that way because the truck's going that way and it'll be a slow boat to sunshine. It's, oh, I've actually, I'm going to have a video, i got to do a video on um, my new um, phone holder in my car. It's a bit higher. It's not on the windscreen like this one. This one's got to be re-glued, I think, because it's slowly coming away from the window, uh, window again. I'm not sure whether it's bumping up and down, so... <laughs> Mum said... To buy a new um, seat for this car. I said, what for? Got a um, other seat for him and his shoulders haven't actually passed that one yet. <coughs> but his shoulders haven't passed the uh, thing on that one yet. Or they might have. But he seems to be more comfortable in that one, guys. Because it sort of sits like that in the back. Lays back a bit. So, oh, Octi oh, fell off. Oh, His suction pads must have worn off. <laughs> Can't park in the uh, emergency now. Have to go into the car park, guys, because um, Arlene's in another area. So we'll have to try and find a. Uh, no way. Uh, not far, We're not far from it, but we have to park in the um, other car park. Yes, Scotty's got to open up his wallet and the moths are all going to come out. I'll send you to Jesus. <laughs> That's what a Scotsman, a Scotsman does.
because he's too tight, he doesn't want to open up his wallet. And when he does open up his wallet, all moths come out. <laughs> oh, seriously, I crack myself up sometimes. Daddy must be a bit tired, it's all that running around. What are you doing? Huh? I'll send you to Jesus. You send me to Jesus? Yes. You can't do that. I haven't been to church yet. Oh, Lordy. Yes, Mr. Beecham. Richmond lost last night. They yeah. actually got done by my brother's team, Footscray. They got slaughtered. It was a Octi slaughterhouse massacre, to be honest. Octi back. Octi and I don't know back. what you're saying, Mr. Adrian Gibson. Octi Jeez, Richmond is shit. Octi's back where he was. Yeah, I'll be back where he is. Oh, no, I have to do something. He's not smiling at the people. We left at 12, uh, what was it? 10 to 12? No, 10 to 11. No, it was 10 to 12 here. Oh, 10 to 11. It's now 12.48. 11. 11. CJ. Yeah. We're good. I swear oh. my son likes to crack some funny ones. I think my wife's going to be in for a big shock. Because mm. she might have to lose some weight. And that won't be the shock. It'll be... Not as much rice as she's being eating. I can hear you. You don't mean. I can hear you, Dad. I'm sending you to Jesus. I don't want to go to Jesus. I'm not ready. Uncle John's up there. Un Uncle John, Johnny um, Beggs is up there. I don't want to go to Jesus yet. <laughs> and besides, Johnny told me he hasn't filled up the fridge yet because God was around his place the other night and drank all his wine. And I said, well, I only drink beer. What's that got to do with wine? Uh, he said, well, I haven't got any beer. I said, yeah, that's because you probably drink it all. He said, yeah, because you're not up here to drink it, and I might go mildewy. I'll send you to Jesus already. CJ, enough. Please. Oh, no, I'm is this where Jesus is? No. CJ thinks he's funny this morning. Yes, I'm ready. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. There's the playground. I wanted to go, but Daddy don't let me. Yeah. Daddy bad. Okay. You don't let me to forever. Yeah, I know. I should spend more time with you. Doing things. 
But do I know someone's got to keep the maintenance up on the house? You can't, you're too young and too short. And the vacuum's too hard for you to push around, so... Just as well as Helen's going to be on Monday doing the house work. Cut that out. <laughs> Why, Dad? Why? Because Daddy's sick of being... I like that. I know you do. I know you like having fun. Shopping centre, that, that's Can Lee. I'll send the shop to Jesus. That's Can Lee there. Jesus, or where Jesus is where God is. <laughs> Jesus and God are the same person. There you go, he's forgotten his Bible lessons. <laughs> CJ. It wasn't me, I didn't fart one million pieces. Excuse you? Jesus. <laughs> Holy moly. Canoli. If, if you say Jesus, you go in Santa Jesus. Back in a minute, guys. And yes, we've got to wear face masks in the hospital. Yeah. I'm back. I got one, CJ has to have one. Yeah. Uh. What's that song I was saying that to Jesus? I don't know. Oh, I'll send it to Jesus. Can you stop that please? <laughs> CJ? Can I just do it please? Yeah, well, do not use the Lord's name in vain, okay? Oh, he's going fast as he can go. <laughs> Come on, enough. I want to do it. I want to do it. Dad's big so cactuses start to come out in that little pointy one now. Soccer field. And I've got to figure out where I'm going to put this other tree. Soccer field. I got some trees that uh, the neighbour Annette over the road gave me in the wheelbarrow still with water in them. But I'm gonna have to take them out because they'll get they'll get water rot and won't be able to um they'll well probably die too much water. But uh, they've been sitting in there for a while. And I need my wheelbarrow to put some rubbish in and then put it in the green bin and I've got that reminds me when I get home tell daddy to put the car on the other side because I need to get the green bag out and throw it and get move the bin green bin out and put the rubbish in the green bin okay can you do that Oh, Lordy. Anyway, guys, this has been Scott Expat in the Philippines with CJ. We won't be too far from and the hospital. And Octi. We'll catch you later, guys. Remember, enjoy life, live life, have fun with life, because life is good. Bye for now.